Gary, a little bit more like uh, your normal self up there tonight. You look a little bit more awake uh, than, than you were in Auckland, averaging nearly 120 for much of that game. Yeah, it felt good. You know, I, I looked and it was 12, 13 darters. You know, everything seemed to be or something like that, double for 13 darts. So, yeah, yeah, a lot better. Still a bit cuckoo land lights, but I reckon Brisbane will be 110%. Well, you got uh, five nil up, and then of course James has got a couple of legs back on you, and but you're quite clinical for closing out the match. Yeah, it was all right up to then. And James, like he said on stage, he, he was a bit nervous. Well, he's, he's going to be, you know. Uh, but once he got into his game and realised it was just up there playing darts, you could see him playing his normal game. So yeah, I'm glad that I got over when I did. So into the uh, second night yet again. Um, you seem to like these uh, these World Series tournaments down here. Yeah, not bad, except for the 24-hour time difference. We're, we're doing all right, though. It really is. Honestly, we, we, we're here in Melbourne, the thickest in the case, you know, there's no daylight. So I don't know if it's night time, day time, morning time, whatever time, but uh, no, it's it's good. I mean, uh, like I say, Rob's first time across doing the World Series across here. Fantastic. Getting to travel the world, see places, play different players. You know, we've seen in New Zealand last week how good the players have come on since the year before. Mm-hmm. And we'll see the same again, you know. Young Corey's coming up, you know, and I'm, I'm, I'll, I'm going, I might sit and watch this one because uh, he, he is good, isn't he? He's a top lad, and um, we we expect him to um, be over with you guys in the not too distant future. You can have him every week. Once every two years is all right, but not every week. I, I can't handle him every. Bloody, no, I can't. Not every weekend. No, but no, it will be. You know, I mean, it'll be a big. If he does come across the UK to settle down and uh, play darts for a living, it's going to be a big change from Kyle's done it. You know, he's he can struggle with it a bit, but uh, yeah, if if he's going to be a proper dart player, which he's, I think he is, he needs to get to sell across and uh, put all the kiddish things behind him and do what he does best, and that's throw darts. Please tell us you aren't going to take him under your wing. I've not got the temperament for Corey. I, I think we'd end up arguing all the time. We would, but no. Listen, he's a great kid. And, uh, no, Marka, Marka's got him. You know, Marka's a good boy. He's got a good head on him. And uh, if Corey can sit back and listen, play his darts how he can, then he's, he's on for a great run over the next five, ten years. Well, in time on the fashion, mate, uh, we'll, we'll see you tomorrow night and see where we go from there. We'll see. Different day.